Ja oikein hyvää päivärskastilla. Tästä lähtee lisää Staasiksen pelailua jälleen kerran. Tätähän ei voi lopettaa kesken mitenkään. Joo, viimeksi pyörittiin niiden kloonien seassa. Ilmeisesti tämä klooni juttu jatkuu, koska täällä on Sunken Generator. A large powered power generator is half submerged in the foul smelling organic soup. Standard growth enhancement agents, 150% concentration plus additional growth hormones obtained from Project Seed, incomplete human clones intended for harvest of permatory and coronary tissues. Tissue. Products developing at 800% acceleration from the selected control group. However, several anomalies have occurred. A novelly example, a tissue mass has developed into a tail of sorts. It circles the vat, using the aforementioned tail to propel itself. Aha, sillä on kehittynyt hand. Mass with tail abundance have been assigned a new Samantha. Despite the previous belief that the circling behavior was a product of instinct, it is now clear that it has been serving the vat's electronic safety net and searching for vulnerabilities. Samantha has been extracted and moved to security for temporary storage. She trashed violently upon removal, damaging equipment and other specimens. Samantalla on siis häntä. Jaa. Mitenköhän tämä informaatio meitä auttaa? Ei varmaan yhtään mitään, mutta katsotaan. Mitäs tää lukee sitten? Subjects appear to develop a bone and tendon structure prior to vital organs, but following nervous system development. Growth of muscle has begun to progress. One specimen ceased to grow and was confirmed dead. Upon autopsy, three extra vertebrae were discovered, as well as two ribs. However, only a few teeth were found deep within the mand mandible. The growth of all specimens has accelerated. Any given clone measures just under seven feet and possesses the auxiliary ribs and vertebrae observed in the failed subject. All vital organs are present and appear to be performing normally, despite the abnormal rib and spinal developments. The clones seem to be perfectly functional and fully m matured. One, however, was rendered blind as a result of improper phenoid development. Se on tää 152D. Missä on 152D? Se olisi kiva nähdä minkälainen se on. Spider webs of cracks radiate outward from several damaged sections of this display panel. No power runs through the terminal. It's busted. Okei. Okay. Mitäs tää termi on sitten? Specimens began to move about the vat immediately during the embryonic phase. All subjects develop in a nearly 500% acceleration. Effect of growth agent consideration concentration on subject development ruled parabolic rather than linear. Multiple subjects have combined uh, to form a larger mass of anthropoid limbs and organs. It surfaced and was then ruled diseased. It appeared to be composed of approximately 12 human-like bodies. All roughly infant side. Sized. Patch has been active for 96 hours. Development of other subjects remains regular. Crossbeam. Voisi mä käyttää tätä siihen crossbeamiin. Voin. Sit mennään ylös siitä, eikö niin? Mennäänkö? Joo. No, sinne jäi mun ainoa työkalu. Valeepä! Missä me nyt ollaan? Aha, me ollaan myös niinku ylöspäin, okei. Okay. Nyt tapahtuu jotain kaunista tässä vaiheessa, kun ollaan kävelemässä ylöspäin tikkaita. Nää perspektiivit on kieltämättä vähän kummallisia. Sitten niin vähän aikaa käsittelee tätä omassa 
pienessä mielessä, että missä me nyt on ja mi- mi- mistä tämä kuvakulma on otettu ja missä on mitä <laughs> tässä, tässä kohdassa peliä, niin vähän kestää. The boarded up entrances indicate that the trams have been out of service for some time. Okei. Okay. Ne on ollut pois pelissä vähän aikaa. Mulla on enää toi täys veri öö, oleva syrinke ja sitten toi drilli. Mä varmaan voi tehdä noille mitä en. Joten mennään kohti. Overheated tram rail. Niin kuin se joku jätkä teki meille kepposia. Tuossa meni joku. Tuossa meni joku jätkä oikealla. Who the fuck was it? Oliko se klouni? Hei, hei. Älä, älä oikeesti pelottele nyt. Okay, I'll get some You mentioned earlier that you lost my BBT. Personal data tag. Every person on board has one. Like animals. The tags monitor everything. Security access, food intake, location tracking. If everyone has a tag, we can use it to find my family. I'm afraid it doesn't work like that, John. Like hell it doesn't. If I'm tagged, then so are they. You said... I can only access your tag because the DotMink scanner has registered you. I've scanned for your family and I can't pick them up. Are they... Are they on the ship? Have they been rescued? It only means their PDTs haven't been activated. But I still have an idea that might just work. That might just work. In the crew quarters. You should be close to an infirmary with a DNA sequencer. If you could get your blood into the sequencer, I can scan the ship for familial DNA. And then we can find your daughter. Then... We can use her DNA to find Ellen. Exactly. Okay, no, mulla on verta. Notice. Reserve power facilities are online. Backup systems are now enabled and functioning at benchmark levels. Mulla on jo tosiaan verta itsestäni kerätty. This whole shift change thing is kind of strange. Putting Ronald in security when he's obviously not equipped strikes me as ir- ir- irresponsible. Oh well, I'm sure I can compensate. A notice went out telling us to follow the new security guidelines this evening. I wonder what happened. It's only a few extra doors to lock. As far as I'm concerned, easy enough. Food supplies are stalled and people are getting nervous. Someone's been distilling alcohol despite the fact that uh, express authorization is required to even possess it. Ivan was describing the concept of moonshine to Ronald, and the guy asked how moonshine could exist if we are in a spaceship so far away from the moon. I swear to god, if aliens board the ship and pick us one by uh, pick us off one by one or something, I want to see Ronald go first. <laughs> <coughs> I really want to do something about this alcohol situation. It's my duty to ensure that the Groom Lake's crew is secure and that important research isn't inf- interfered with. At least I would like to believe so. These sh- clowns don't share the sentiment. The ass end of the ship just started exploding and jolted everything that wasn't bolted down. There's a goddamn Ben stuck in the wall next to me. I can only imagine all the people injured right now, but can't leave on account on the lockdown. Lockdown or not, Station B is fucked. So getting to medical isn't happening. Someone suggested that we could use the specimen transport track, but that's shady as hell. As all hell. There's no leaving the security center now. Staring at Ronald's lifeless body is a fucking superior alternative to being ripped apart by whatever outside. I hear screams. Their distance are muffled. 
Silence, 24 hours of silence, not a scream, not a footstep. Still not a word from Ivan. The guy looked away from the atmosphere control room, just before Ronald pulled out the block. I got bored and read the Ronald's file. He had a lot of stuff running really deep, maybe w he wasn't ignorant after all. That's it for the water. I refused to drink anything but moonshine. I tried my best to get him to have water. Stop on Bastard wouldn't hear it. He hasn't moved in a while. Yeah, that get the pontica. You know. On the other lisa textia. This new guy, Anderson, is real something. Five minutes in the door and he's already asking what all the computers do. I like it. He's inquisitive. And just like my boy back home, I'm glad he got uh, put here into shift change. But I'm disappointed that neither of these two are ladies. I could use some female company. Okay, maybe Anderson is a little more confused than inquisitive. But his heart is in the right place. I can respect that. But Sarge? How in the hell did the boy get Sarge from Surato? Paul is just plain obnoxious. Food's not coming for a while. Unfortunately, someone's been making moonshine. It's not white oak whiskey from back home, but you don't come across much liquid, liquid in space. Looks like I'll be moderating the supply, so to speak. Hudson's just tried to arrest someone. Prick. Rations are in. Good thing too. The liquor wasn't keeping the crew at bay like it used to. This entire ship smells like shit. It's always been bad, but it gets worse every day. It's even different type of shit every once in a while, beyond me. Chrome Lake is locked down. Tremors, power outtakes, and several injured. Some guys left three days ago to repair a tram station. Haven't heard from them since. I can only hear... Uh, I can only fear the worst. And I don't want to wait figure out what's been going on, on around here. Paul and I have agreed on a solution, but Anderson isn't grasping it. I don't expect him to. I knew Anderson would have trouble gooping. I knew he wouldn't understand. At least he went uh, easier than we will. He saw so much in his short life. There was just... There wasn't room for more. He'll never have funeral. Nobody back home is going to think of him and wonder what happened. I think Paul and I are the only people on the ship who knew him by name. Maybe th maybe that Samantha girl was talking about still remembers him. Her dog could be named after him, or maybe he picked her f he picked her a flower and she ducked it into a book. Book. I never did read much, but right now I would love to be holding a book. Bo would work. He's the only author I know by name. I haven't talked to Paul. He thinks I'm drinking, but I'm too preoccupied with Anderson for that. I figure I'm writing this for a reason. What if nobody ever reads it? What if the ship just drifts to the edge of the universe, dead and empty? If you exist, if you somehow stumble upon this, remember Anderson for me. He reminds me uh, so much of how my son used to be. If you don't do it, nobody will. I don't beg. I never beg. But if you're a decent human, you'll know why you have to. Remember Anderson. Barely awake. Typing is an effort. Moonshine is not water. Hodgson's last. Had last word. Jaha. No, tos vähän aukesi tätä Grimmenbergen omia ajatuksia. Tuolla on to tappavaa kaasua jotain. Tuolla ei näe tällä hetkellä yhtään mitään. Yksi kamera on boosted down ja toisessa kamerassa on joku... Mikä tuolla lukee? Ei mä saa selvä. Katsotaan mitä täällä on. Aha, motion detectori varmaan tosta tee mitään. Jep. Yes you do. Tästä luki nää security logit. Alcohol is being manufactured and distributed aboard the Groom Lake. Security has op opted to take the approach of non-intervention. And as its effect, o effect on moral will likely prevent theft and potential riots associated with the limited ration rations. However, security will regularly confiscate quantities of alcohol to moderate the supply. Confiscate. On the bike, on the Rations have arrived and been distributed. Very few reported or evidential causes of death. This can be likely to be attributed to the moral increase, speculated as a result of the distribution of alcohol. 
Specimen Samantha received for transport to Laboratory 18. This specimen from the cloning vats is contained in an iron lung. Transport needs to be arranged quickly. Specimen is scraping against the inside of the containment unit. Eikö tämä Samantha ollut just se, mille kasvo se häntä? Tremors have struck the groom leg. Power outtakes and severe injuries have been reported. Lockdown is in effect. Four crew members have been reported missing while attempting to restore a tram station to work in order. To prevent further loss or injury, the corridor has been sealed and flooded with highly corrosive gas. Okay. Se ainakin kertoo ton sen yhden kameran, missä on laitettu gääsyä. Once we know where Becker is, how can I get to her? There is another tram through the crew quarters. Once we know where you're going, we'll move forward from there. More trams. Smile. Let us look at. For. We can. God forgive us. God forgive us. Okay, no. Oi. Älä, älä nyt pelleile. I'm getting sick of this bumps and scrapes bullshit. I didn't get this degree just so that I could stitch idiots up when they accidentally stab themselves with a pen. I want to do fun experiments. Is that too much to ask? It's not, li not like I want to be a mad scientist and sue new arms onto people or anything. Although human spiders would be cool. Okay. <laughs> It's a miracle. Security somehow ended up passing a container from one of the cloning vats onto me. It's labeled Samantha. They understand it's to be transferred to the lab 18, right? Oh well, no reason to... C I can't observe it for a while, right? I'll have my loyal assistant, Miriam, make up some good excuses for me. This creator is marvelous. The notes included don't say much, but I'm pretty sure that she didn't have a full, fully formed spine when they backed up... Backed this girl up. It described her as a being just as a tail. There are some other bones as well, but I didn't ma but I didn't major in monster and anatomy. I wish I had though, you can't make this shit up. This fucker grew eyes. I mean it, she did not have these the last time I checked. They're rudimentary, sure, but they're just crew. They follow me around. At this point I'm going to take the credit for Samantha entirely. I mean they can't prove that there was uh, there was anything more than some steam cells in that container the last they saw it, right? From now on, Samantha is mine. I can't wait to see what she turns into. Lap 18 is definitely getting suspicious and impatient. I'm running out of excuses for why I haven't transferred Samantha yet. I need Miriam to stall a bit longer. I read her BDA, so I know she wants to turn me in. She wants my job. Fortunately. I have a video of her screwing the guys from the lab, all of them, so there's my job security. This just got serious. The tremors knocked me over the uh, over the counter and I twisted a muscle in my knee. It's going to be a long lockdown spent bandaging people up with any, ac any access to the full medical wing. Samantha isn't mine anymore. Some other pool fall. Poor fall fool can take responsible responsibility for this one. I heard shrill screams coming from the entertainment area. The first and last time I, p I performed surgery, the patient woke up and started screaming her head off. Something about seeing your own exposed ribs really bothers people. Anyway, these screams were were like that, only more intense. The, the screams of the dying. I have locked the emergency bulkhead. No signs of Miriam. Yeah. Ja kyllä varmasti porukka huutaa. Samat ribit näkyy. I don't see an access panel. It must be the secondary containment. Give me some time. Uh, nee, oli vähän pimeät. Tossa se teidän askanneri. I think this is it. Excellent. You need to get your blood sample onto the receiving tray, and uh, I'll do the rest. Okay. Okay, it's working. Receiving the genetic info. This is good, John. This is excellent. I 
right. I can hear something. Helvetti se oli. Tuolla takaa liikkuu joku. Oliko tää se Samantha? Joo, okei. Jaha. The constant flickering of its lies does... Okei, tää on elevator, okei. Tonne pääsee. Tram station door. Oh yeah. Wait. Uh, 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 uh. Niin elikkä toi oli se huone, jossa oli tota... Joo. Se kaasu. Kerros. Se on se Samantha, eikö okki? The uh, quartz of monitor face you with a blank so... Dead plants. Once intended to brighten up the room, the shrubbery is now bone dry and the leaves are flaking. Naston. A black... Groom. Mä oon kyllä pakko myöntää, että tää peli pelottaa minua enem enemmän kuin ikinä joku Silent Hill. Anteeksi nyt vaan. <laughs> ja tää on tämmöisestä perspektiivistä kuvattu vielä. Hmm. Mä en ois uskonut, että joku peli pystyy saamaan noin kuvan reaktion. Ai se on. En mä kattonut, että se on joku kuilu. Katos. On kaksi asiaa, mitä pystyy lukemaan. Sweat and mildew wave. Waft of the unwashed linen. Organic growth. The root-like growth have become affixed to the wall where here is clustered braid. Okay. I couldn't even be bothered to get out of bed today. Nobody came asking questions though, so that works. Sometimes when I first wake up, I wait as long as possible to say my first word of the day. Then that word serves as a prediction of how shitty that day is going to be. Naturally, Isabella woke me up by asking if I would rather fuck Rand or Harry. I thought she was supposed to be some kind of feminist who doesn't need, need a man. Hypocrite. To answer the question, I would need to do a bit of research. Harry will suffice for that. I guess I'm obligated to write about the ship lockdown since it's all life threatening or something. I don't know why we even carry this BDA. Seriously, I will never go back and read this shit. The groom laid got a 300% funding increase and I have a feeling we're going to we're going to 
we are doing some more shady bullshit with it. Welcome aboard to the Groom Lake, where as far as the universe is concerned, you don't exist. And as far as the board is concerned, you don't exist. Nothing actually exists. Humanity is gonna flip shit when they finally figure that out. So, Grant's gay. I knew I had to see him and check him Harry out. Lips are sealed. That again, for Matthew. It's going to be a long, painful death if we don't get those rations soon. I might have to start murdering and eating my blockmates. I'll start with Grant because he's he got the most meat on him. Harry is the last because I'm in no hurry to put my mouth on that again. <laughs> hey, so, someone's making some booze. Humanity has truly reached the apex of engineering. Space moonshine. It brings a smile to my eye and a tear to my heart. Get me some. Taste, 0 out of 10. Effectiveness, 10 out of 10. This stuff has to be at least 120 proof. Had to do something I totally don't regret to get it. And it, it was worth it. Liquid supply is running low. Food supply is high. I'm disappointed. Here I was thinking I would be enjoying the moonshine marinated lake of Grand this evening. Disappointed. At least I didn't starve. Oh, on the one hand, something exciting happened. On the other hand, we're probably going to die or something. I have no regrets. Not even the thing I did. I did to get the moonshine. I have been thinking about it over the last couple of days, and I sincerely can't think of anything I regret. Not hooking up with Harry, not pursuing music instead of physics. Nothing. It was all part of what made my life mine. Life carries on, no matter what, so I guess it's the it's best to just be satisfied with what little I did accomplish. The universe swallows you atom by atom eventually, you know. I'm proud of how far those atoms made it. From when they first get cut together to form Shelby Cushions to where they are now. Okay. Han Pani. Harriä ilmeisesti. Tää on Isabella Spaldingin logi. Another long day in hydroponics. I planted carrots today. This place seriously sucks, but I figure the longer I work for Kane Corp, the sooner they'll be able to replace this defective uterus of mine. Harry is uh, protective, and I and not in a cute way. It makes me feel a little uncomfortable. His attempts to protect my honor, his words, whenever Krantz even looks at me are unveiling familiar, just like my ex-husband used to do. I'm not ready for another round of that bullshit. Half of the ship has been has been on lockdown for two long weeks. Apparently some new scientists spotted today, so maybe they'll be able to resolve this issue. But what do I know? I make vegetables reproduce for a living. I have to admit, Harry's whole stalker thing can be great sometimes. He's growing herbs for me so that I can make a tea. With all of this new security bullshit, I wouldn't dare use company resources personally like that. I have been pretending to like Grant just a little bit. I don't, but it keeps Harry on his toes. Harry opted to stay on the groom lake for another uh, uh, for another round. He was eligible to leave at the shift change, but he chose to stay. Gee, I wonder why he'd do that. He's a grown man, for goodness sake. But he's acting like a lovesick teen. He needs to stop fucking calling me Belle, though. It's Isabella, like the Queen of Spain. I keep hearing chatter about fungal growth spreading all over the groom lake. Let's hope it doesn't get here to hydroponics. It would be devastated if anything happened to my precious celery. Spoke way too soon. I came into Hydra today to find everything coated in this strange fungus. Harry actually had a pretty good idea. What if we fought the fungus with genetically enhanced super mushrooms? <laughs> nope, cross breeding mushrooms did not improve things. Hopefully the emergency races will get there soon. Here soon. Unless people want to eat the portobellos from hell, that is. This ship shit is about to get dangerous. People have been beaten up. Some are even dead. We have seen a lockdown before, but it wasn't a mass panic like this. Will it be over soon or ever? Harry told me to stay in the sleeping block because it could be dangerous outside, you know. I have taken care of myself for 28 years without help from Harry. I think I can handle myself. I'm not going to spend the final days of my life playing the helpless female. I'm not going to cling to Harry, even if he's the last human being I'll ever see. He can't expect anything from me. Täällä oli siis kaksi naista, jotka olivat vähän tekemässä siis ruokaa. Tai jotain kasvattamassa asioita. Ja, ja, ja se funkusi joku sienikasvusta tuli tonne lopulta ja 
nopeasti tällä alkoi tapahtua asioita ja kaikki menivät päin persettä. Another gruesome victim of the indiscriminate slaughter. This one has strangely fistful look on his face, as if we were imagining as an escape into the jeery landscape under the walls. You'll know what's worse than being a janitor, being a space janitor. The shit I literally have to put up with is unbelievable. I mean it. My job is to control the recycling of methane with expulsion from human waste. Shitty is an understatement. Plus, I can barely understand my co-worker. I think he's Polish, but he only speaks Spanish. Uh, Isabel's been talking to me. I hope she doesn't have any ideas. I'm really n not into that. Even if she was a guy, she's just so difficult to deal with. I think she's purposefully leaves some shadow of the doubt that she might have some feelings for Harry. Just so that he'll hang around. The poor guy is obsessed. It's creepy, but it's also the teeniest bit sweet. Eli siellä oli yksi homo. I think Jupiter is finally done grown. She was such a cute little kitten. Now she's big and doesn't cuddle anymore. Harry's allergic. He thinks that I keep Jupiter around just to mess with him. Really, I don't. She gets in the way sometimes, but she's the only living thing that really understands me. I love that little kitten. Big kitten. Isabella smacked Harry straight across the face today. I think he called her a pet name to her face. I would have been flattered. Poor guy. Everything is so uneventful around here. Maybe that's a good thing. I've been trying to talk Isabel to see if she's interesting in Harry. I don't think so, but I want to make sure. It would make it would help me sleep a little better. Uh, interdepartmental pool to win 64 days of leave. What a joke. Kitchen, security and maintenance are, aren't even eligible. But they're the ones to keep the ship running. Oh wait, I guess that makes sense. This fungus shit is everywhere. It's already it's already in the methane collection plant. Shelby is such a cow. She says she says she hopes it gives me cancer, but that way I could start over with the new organs courtesy of uh, King Corp, of course. I told her that there was uh, only one organ I really wanted, but that Harry was too busy following Isabella. Shelby said, "Oh, it all makes sense now. You go, girl." But I'm not a girl. Could it be worse? I just hope she can keep a secret. I don't want everyone involved in my business. This mushroom plan that hydroponics came with is not working. If anything, it's made life in the plant just a little more grueling. People have been complaining to me about weird smells coming from the vents. I swear it's not the plant. I can smell it too. Emergency rations. I snuck some food to Jupiter first. She was acting a little loopy. I noticed just today that Harry has the most adorable way of stuffing his face. He always inspects whatever he is about to eat before he takes a bite, then shows um, as much as as much in his mouth as he can. Ah, the simple things. Powers out and plays around the ship. Hopefully, the plant isn't next. That sure wouldn't end well. I haven't seen Jupiter since the tremors. I can only make assumptions. Oh God, I hope she's safe. I don't want Harry to get hurt in all of this either. He's such a little guy. I've been following Isabella around, get closer to Harry and make sure he's okay. I don't know what's going on, but suddenly it doesn't matter whether or not he could ever care about me. Those guys who went work on Station B haven't come back yet. I've been trying to sleep as much as I can now. So I can stay on my toes when everything goes to hell. I have cried a little as well, partly because of Jupiter and partly for reasons I don't understand. I don't want to burden Harry by telling him about how I feel. I know it will just confuse and upset him. I'm really hopeful that we'll all make it out of here. But Shelp is per pessimist and contagious. I don't know. Will I... Will I ever have another chance to open my heart to someone? I'll have to hope so. I just can't tell Harry. Belle says she's fine, but I'm going to keep an eye an eye on her. I had a nightmare that Belle killed herself, so I checked on her just to be sure. I hope I didn't wake her. Grant would have checked on her. That dick doesn't know how to care for a lady. Not a lady like Belle. I sure hope nobody catches me growing these herbs. Space is so empty and cold, and Belle seems like she's she needs the comfort. I don't care if I get caught. But if I did but if I did get caught, Belle would know that I would truly do anything for her. 
Belle seems super frustrated today. I stopped asking what was wrong because she got really mad at me the other day when I did that. I feel like I'm making her angrier every time I speak to her. She's upset and I can't do anything about it. She spoke to me today. I'm so glad everything is okay. I lost so much sleep over her last night. If she only knew, she would feel so special. Krentz keep bringing his goddamn cat into the sleeping block. I'm allergic and he knows it. I shouldn't need a shot of... Uh, Effifrien? Effi... Effifrien frien. <laughs> Every time I go to bed. He thinks he's a badass because he managed to sneak a cat on board. Pell probably thinks he's so cool. Why can't she see that he's a total dick? I d decided to stay on the groom lake so that I can be with Belle. I don't like it here, but I love her. Some guy in engineer says that there's a fungus on the ship. I wonder if it's poisonous. If it is, I bet I could hijack a lifeboat to fly Belle home. The fungi is all over in hydroponics. I have an idea though. What if we engineer another invasive fungus to take out the alien one? I honestly don't think it will work. I suggested it's a joke at first, but hell. But Bell <laughs> thought it was a great idea, so now we have to do it. Grant's been following Bell and I everywhere. I know she thinks he can keep her safe, but I know he can't, so he's full of himself. I think Grant's cat died during the tremors and the chaos. Good fucking riddance. The guy has been sopping for almost a day now. Maybe now Bell will understand that he's not fit to protect her. I think I would die for Bell. It's pretty much been established that something's running around and killing people. I'm going to fight it when I see it. It will only get to Bell over my dead body. She'll die knowing that I gave my life ch life just to take a couple of seconds to be doing other. Siis tää puolusti ja... Niin, se ei paljon auttanut vissiin. Tarina syvenee, mutta täällä on vissiin mitään kerättävää vaan, eikö? eikö? Ainakaan tän mukaan ei näytä olevan missään mitään. Hmm. Pistäis tohon... Save. Tonne noin, save game. Sitten tää alkoi huutaa mulle, kun mä tästä tein jotain juttuja. Alright. Ei. No nyt se jää tohon keskelle toi juttu, hei. That's not cool. Saa kuitenkin pois tän exit? Okei. Okay. Entertainment block door. Mitä mulla on käyttämättä? Mulla on vielä käyttämättä se... No, se kattoo nyt. <hys> Markkia taas siellä niinku viimeksi. Mulla on se drilli vielä käyttämättä, joten... Hmm. No tonne me ei enää päästä takaisin, koska... Siellä tuli se lockdown ja tonne ei pääse enää, joten... Täällä on se yksi ovi. Just fucking open. Just fucking open. A motion detec detection device has been installed above the door. I don't think that'll work. Mun pitäisi saada joku... Mun se kattaa sen PDA-ta. Mun pitäisi saada niinku dragättyä tohon joku juttu. How do I do that? Eli siis tää on se pääarea, missä on se elevatori. Tää on se huone, mikä on täynnä kaasua. Tää on vissi se entertainment blogi. Vai onko se tämä sitten? Se on varmaan tämä. Mikä, mikä tää sitten on? Mikä kysymys? Tää tosiaan käynnistää tosta tommosen. Mut mä en pysty samaan aikaan liikkumaan, joten... Hmm. Mikä olisi tämän ratkaisu? En mä sitä halua koskea. Se pitäis jotenkin niinku manuaalisesti tai... Uh, life support. Slumbers of a dead body. Atmospheric control access terminal. 
Eli tä- tänne mun pitää päästä, että mä saan sen kaasun pois. Mutta... Hmm. Aika jännä, että mä katon tuonne, niin tuo paljastuu ton, ton paikan sisus. Tota, hmm. Tää on joku taas pieni yksityiskohta, minkä mä missaan, mutta kannattaa katsoa tarkemmin. Kuollut puhuu. No, ei se sinne pitänyt mennä. Tota ei pysty avata, kun tuolta alhaan näkyy itse asiassa tuo kaasukki ihan vihjeenä, että Don't fucking go there! <laughs> Katsotaan nämä paikat vähän tarkemmin, kun PDAt kerran luettiin jo. Turn of floor grating, sleeping god. Tää saattaa olla joku esine, mikä voi kerätäkin ja mä en siitä ole tietoinen ollenkaan. Mä nyt katon tarkasti vaan asiat läpi. Organic growth. Tosta ei varmaan... Joo, mä en uskakaan, että se toimii. Mulla on vielä toi pora käyttämättä, joten sillä voi jotain tehdä. Tää koko paikka on mennyt ihan paskaksi. Something serious happened here. Ja siellä on kärpäsiä vaikka kuinka paljon. I don't know what I was Ei, mä haluaisin testata ihan asiaa, että kuuluuko se... Kuulu. Aika jännä. Semmonenkin yksityiskohta tässä pelissä huomioitu, että kun sä menet lähelle näitä kärpäsiä, niin se ääni kuuluu vain tästä kovempaa. <laughs> What a nice attention to detail. Mutta täällä ei... Sleeping kotteja on vaan paljon, mutta kun täällä ei ole mitään semmoista, mikä auttaisi meitä... I think that'll just break. No voi ei, ei. Miksi minä aina teen noin? Miksi mä aina menen Windowsiin? <laughs> Joo, ei me pediaita lueta. Hmm. Papers. Ei vaan näy mitään semmoista, mitä mä voisin napata. Uh. Kunhan se ei tosiaan oo... Mikä todella pieni yksityiskohta, minkä voi kerätä. Tai ehkä mun ei pidetä, pitää kerätä yhtään mitään vielä. Ehkä mun pitää vaan keksiä joku. Onko mulla aikaa josta karkku, jos mä laitan ton päällä? En tiedä, onko se mitään väliä, koska se kaasu kumminkin täyttää tämän paikan, ja mä pään etenemään. Voin mä koittaa, että jos sitä ihan vaan pistää seivi tohon ja... Ja ja, testataan. Oho. Nyt jää pukaan taas toi. Paino vahingon ekstittiä. Joo. Ei pysty liikuttaa hahmoa siinä ajassa. Ei pysty liikuttamaan, joo. Taas toi on vissiin viimeinen load game. Um. Steam. Steam wafts constantly upward, though it's more... Okei. Okay. Mä tarvisin jotain siihen tota... Hmm. Pidän skanneriin, mutta... Ehkä mä voin laittaa siihen skanneriin itsessään jonkun asian. No tänne ei pääse. Ja tonne ei pääse. Piti tutka... 
piti testata, että onko se sama asia kuin ensimmäisessä ruudussa, ensimmäisessä ruudussa kun mentiin. Mutta... Tolle pitää tehdä jotain. Mutta mitä? Ja nämä security kamerat ei vissi. No, näistä vaan näkee. Me oletan, että toi joku visuaalinen kiuva, että sinne. Sille oikein muuta pysty tekemään. Okei, tässä ei pysty liikkumaan samaan aikaan. Sekin on testattu. I can't see it working like that. En minäkään usko. I don't know what I was thinking there. I don't know what I was thinking there. Mulla on ihan semmonen fiilis, että nyt mun pitää mennä sinne. No, tässä ei oo mitään hotspottia enää. Toi mä luettiin jo. Siis me pitää mennä tänne näin. Ja ja. Meidän pitää sieltä saada sitten jotain. Kysymys vaan kuuluu, että mitä? Mm. Crumb like a discarded memo. The guts of the level below lie exposed. Where's that organic growth there? Yeah. That's just crazy. Although... Mä mielestä, että... Mitä noi on? Mitä noi oikein tuolla ylhäällä on? I don't think this will fit. Onks noi ne... Nää kahden tyypin... Ruumiit? Ilmeisesti. Hmm. Totta niinku fankosta vois käyttää varmaan siihen monitorihommaa. Mutta mulla ei oo mitään millä leikata sitä, se on se ongelma nyt. Hyi, kun tuolla on tommosia. Ei oo joo. Mä en huomaa mistään. Mistään mitään. Hmm. Mä oon se moneen kertaan se, ok. Cross the floor. Hei, bed locker. Mitäs siellä? The locker is open but empty. Mitäs toi lockeri? Uh, minkä mä sain? Pet sheet. Entäs palaitan pet sheetin siihen kameran päälle? Vai tarviiko tää kostuttaa vielä jossain? Öö, toi. No, 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 Bitch sheet. This isn't gonna work. Hmm. Okay, se ei riittänyt vielä. Mun täytyy käyttää se jossain, mutta missä? Hmm. Maybe. Maybe. No. 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 Toinen ei auta kyllä yhtään mitään. <laughs> Siitä voi olla varma. Mutta okei, tommosia yksityiskohtia tuolla on siis piilossa, mutta mä en äsken semmosia huomannu. Niinku lockerit tosiaan. Hmm. Mm. I don't think this will fit. Mihinkään tota tarvitaan sitten? Siis se on niinku linen bed sheet. Joo. Täällä on niin paljon kärpäsi, ettei... Oh, oh. 
miten sitä koskee. Tässä huoneessa ei varmaan ole mitään enää. Mut siinä toisessa huoneessa on jotain. Katsotaan mitä. This isn't gonna work. Tää nyt menee ihan arvailun puolelle kyllä nyt. Vähän niinku vankilasta. Okay. Now let's see what I can do. Vähän niinku vankilasta olisi karannu. Niin voidaan tästä mennä itsemme alas. Joo. Okei. Mä luulen, että mä kuolin sinne, mutta en sen tämän. Okei, okay, hyvä, päästi eteenpäin. Damn it! How the hell am I gonna get back up? God, John, you're gonna get yourself killed. Hey, this is all new to me. Mut se oli kumminkin looginen ratkaisu tohon, tohon bedsheetin käyttöön. Se oli joku, että se, että mä peitän sen skanneri ja sitten se menee sekaisin jotenkin, tai sitten toi, että mä käytän sitä tommosena naruna ja menen alas tästä reijestä, mikä oli toisessa huoneessa. A massive open drainage pipe rings the center of the room, just barely protruding above the flood of sludge. Unresent, science officer, level, security level 2, security level 0. A sludge. Mutta tosiaan tässä pelissä on semmosia yksityiskohtia, mitä ei välttämättä niinku... Se pitäisi vaan tosi rauhallisesti katsoa ympäriinsä ja lukea näitä tekstejä, että mitä ympärillä lukee. Wow. Oh, se on se Jupiteri. Se on se Jupiteri. 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 Manji feline purrs uncaringly at its present precadent. I won't hurt you. Tota, se kuulostaa erittäin pissed off. What the? I can't believe that just happened. Yeah. Joku syö sitä kissaa nyt tällä hetkellä. Every single day, Grant brings his poor little cat to the plant. I swear to God, it's going to die of methane inhale, inhalation. I did a number of my, on my ankle. Doc says I'll need to keep any weight off of it for a few days. I hope Grant can pick up the slack for me. Some of these idiots think that the fungus spreading through the groom lake was caused by aliens. The place is disgusting, so of course it's going to be an overrun with mold. A few guys tried to get the uh, tram station be repaired. I want to go and help, 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 but I don't know shit about trams or stations anyway. They haven't come back yet, so everyone's more than a little worried. The guys in sleeping block B are absolutely fucked. I'm reasonably sure that we're next. Stacy almost didn't make it. Make it in. Poor girl's too young for this. That's funny though. Who is old enough for this? Who reaches a point in their life where they figure they're ready to be ripped apart by God knows what? Hyvä kysymys. Erittäin random loading screen taas. Why? Why do we need a loading screen here? Jaha. Pump station terminal. Jaha, tää niinku laskis veden ja tää nostaa veden. Tota... This is the elevator to the annex. Can you climb it? No. It's just the shaft, I can't see an entrance. No pistetaa vesi alas sitten. Go down. Kes ääni se oli? 
Tuommoinen Mario ääni. Du, du. What? Mitäkään nää oikein tarkoittaa? Hyvä kysymys. Nää äänet. Tyry. Tota. A row of walls control the re 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 release of various tubes. Pipes. Tim. Methane is explosive, right? Highly. Why would there be methane tanks under the crew quarters? Kane doesn't care about safety. They're driven by profit. Täällä on leakin methane gassia. Se kuulostaa erittäin vaaralliselta. Koita saada tästä nyt jotain selvää. Tuolla on yksi niinku punainen tankki. Okei, okay, tää, tää on neljä tankkiä, mitkä on tuolla, mutta mitä nää tarkoittaa sitten? Tästä tulee se vettä sit vesi sisään vai? Ja mitä nää meinaa sitten? Mä voi kääntää kun kahteen suuntaan. Kuva vaan tos vähän aikaa, mä oikein tiedän mitä se meinaa on. Aa, kato se muuttuu joka kerta. Muuttuu joka kerta. Nyt se ei kyllä muutu mihinkään. Nyt se on koko ajan sama. Onko se koko ajan ollut sama? On se missä koko ajan sama. Tää on kyllä ihan arvailu, mitä se pitää tehdä. Then until I figure that out. Karta nämä muut alueet sillä aikaa. Takaisin Sludgeen. Tuolla on korpsa ja tuolla on muutama valve. Pump station diagram. Jos mä haluan sen alaspäin, niin alas ylös. Ylöspäin on toi merkki, mikä tuolla on. Elikkä... Alright. Mut mikäs toi alas merkki sitten on? Alas... Ylös, ylös... Ja sitten nois lopuista on irronnut toi merkki, niin ei tiedä mikä se koodi on. Hmm. Okei, okay, pitääkö siitä arvata vai? Vai ei? Kumminkin kolme ensimmäistä merkkiä siinä vissiin saa, ellei toi ensimmäinen merkki jotenkin ihan tarkoituksella tällainen. Vähän vinossa. Corps. <laughs> Sillä karkuu, kun mä klikkaan sitä. Fallen creating. Uh, all right. Vending machine. Ei toiminut. Another corpse. Television screens, pool table, another corpse. See that these people were just killed. I didn't skin. Eaten? No. I went hunting with my uncle when I was a kid. I know what skinning looks like. I did it myself, but when I 
I saw. I'm a vegetarian. <laughs> I'm a veg vegetarian. Mikä se oli? A pool cue. Siis biljardi se vehe. Keppi. Tammy and I had a great evening together. This mystery alcohol is pretty much a miracle. It made my throat burn terribly though. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh my god, I thought I was literally going to starve. This stupid fungus crap ruined all the food. We finally got a delivery and it was great to eat something. The new food isn't as good as the food Hydro makes though. I wonder if Gain Corp would let me volunteer for a project seed. Surely they give give you some great benefits for volunteering. Uh, you just have to... You just have to have been pregnant before, I think. Do abortions disqualify you? I'll look into it. Nope. They need volunteers who have actually birthed a baby. Birthed. Or miscarried late in the pregnancy. You also have to be at least 18 years old for for whatever reason. How did Kane know I was 17 anyway? I thought those documents looked darn realistic. Oh well, I guess I uh, didn't want a bunch of experiments on me anyway. I'm literally freaking out. The groom leg went out like boom, and then stuff started falling and shaking. I almost got a fork stuck in my neck. A jeb got uh, got caught under a bed. Now I feel bad for calling him a creepy old man all the time. I had a good idea. I said we could should use the tubes that we sent the experiments to to get people to the medical because the trams are broken. Everyone loves me now. Tammy's going to help. She's so brave sometimes. I would go too, but she said not to. She's kind of like a mom to me, but she said that would be weird because we're best friends. Tammy's not back yet. I don't know what to do. If I never had that stupid idea, she would be okay. It's my fault. Robin says it's not my fault, but I know it is. I'm just so stupid and all useless. And useless. <laughs> like I was at home. I don't even have a home. All I do is hurt people. I want them to get me. I killed Tammy and now it's my turn. Z Zane carried me to the rec recreation area. I kicked and screamed as loud as I could, but he dragged me in anyway. I wish I could be a good person like him. I'm useless. I think I'll slip by the door so that they'll get me first. Maybe I can buy everyone else a second or two. Jaha, siellä on joku tyyppi, joka on erittäin ikävöis huonolla fiiliksellä omasta päätöksestään. This looks like a recent addition. Holographic. This is a useful drill. I'm not like Lulee, but she'll probably do something to get me to stop. Maybe she'll have to kill some people or something. Tai tää tehdä joku harhautus, niin tuo on varmaan hy hyötykäyttöä siihen. I can't believe I'm actually in space! I know that a whole lot of people have been here, but you really don't appreciate the cosmos until you've seen beyond Earth atmosphere. It's not something to be taken for granted. I hope this is the beginning of a long journey for me. If I could just live in the void of eternity, I would give anything. I don't miss Earth at all. Unbelievably, the cases of passing asteroids are less cold than most humans. It's amazing to see all of the constellations up close and personal. I've started writing a comic about myself, the space adventurer. Although I've just been sweeping and dusting on the groom lake, I know it's my key to becoming one with the cosmos. My comic book is coming along nicely. I've decided that I'm not going to make myself a superhero. But I'll lead a term of super geniuses and, well... Uh, we'll use the power of the universe to save it. My sidekick is Carl Sagan. Einstein pilots the Bride Bond. That's my awesome ship. And Hawking crushes stuff with his cybernetic glimpse. Issue 1 done. Uh, despite what I've been going through, I still love space. I have seen enough movies to know how this is going to end for me. I wish my comic, uh, wish my comic books hadn't been lost in the tremors. They were pretty much the final testament. I even finished issue 6. We destroy a race of parasitic squid-like guys, except we keep one as a pet and train it to fight for us. It also bites Einstein, who gets a cool scar as a result. Anyway, it's too late for that. I'm gonna spend my final days taken in the universe through any window I can find. Peace out, universe. Okay. Täällä ei varmaan mitään muuta oo, vai oisko? 
Joo, se on lukittu se ovi, niin ei pääse. Alright. Oho, onpas nautusta kulunut taas aika paljon. No. Joo, se pump stationi varmaan pitää... Siinä on se ulkona se hintaus siihen, että mitä sinne... Mitä sinne pitäisi sitten, tota, tai missä järjestyksessä ne pitäisi laittaa ne nuolet siihen. Ja sit, jos haluat ylös, jos haluat alas. Tossa on nimittäin toi vihje siihen. Mutta... Viedetään tämä pelailu tältä kertaa tähän paikkaan. Eiköhän me jatketa seuraavalla kerralla. Eikö niin? Kyllä. Tämä on aika jännäksi. Tässä oli paljon dialogia tässä osassa. Ja hyvä, että luin muuten kaiken. Kaikki nämä tapahtuu, mitä täällä tapahtuu ympärillä. Kaikki ruumit sun muut, niin ne on sijoitettu. Niin on vähän, vähän enemmän järkeä, kuin oikeasti perehtyy noihin PDA-filuihin. Eiks niin? Kyllä. Joten... Seuraavaan kertaan. Se on moro.